All right, so we finally got, uh, I guess, gameplay for Seven Deadly Sins Genshin Cross Origins. So let's just get right into it and see what we got here. It's a two minute video. Um, I'm gonna be pausing a bit so I don't get copyright claimed or striked or whatever, just cause I, I, I don't know how Netmarble does it. I know that they try to sue uh, one of the, uh, no, they didn't sue. They did a, They gave a cease and desist for one of the data miners and then, yeah. <laughs> Seven Deadly Sins Origins gameplay in GDC. I'm not sure what GDC is. So is that your Paimon? This looks pretty good. Hold on, let me see. Oh, I hate it when it's on auto. This looks pretty cool. Now, is this, this is supposed to be an action game too. I've seen like stills from the game video is based on an early development version for GDC play did you change like the whole world okay so you have like the mountain in the background was that there after You have a different mountain in the background. Oh, that's a whole different... Okay, so it looks like they went back to the past where it was, like, clean and nice. You got a castle in the background. Oh, you have mounts? Like, I think I've heard about the mounts before. This is turn base? Is this, like... Is this, like, encounters... Or are you going to fight them on the field? Because if it... I, hmm. That's pretty good. I see that they took the art from uh, Seven Deadly Sins. Like, if you go over here, you got Doogie Hauser and... Uh, I'm so mad that I'm forgetting his name. I'm just call him Gilgamesh. The enemies look good, though. The animations on the enemies, too. I haven't played Seven Deadly Sins in so long. What the hell is that? So you have your map on the top right over here. You got... What looks to be kind of like the same symbols from Seven Deadly Sins Grand Cross. So it looks like they used quite a bit of uh, assets when it comes to like menus and art. Which honestly I don't really see a problem with it. Especially if... Uh, like it's, it's net marble doing a seven deadly sins game again but for okay so you can fly over you can swim and you can go underwater okay <laughs> what's the uh what are the recommended specs for for for, for someone to run this game is this a pc only game or is this i don't know if this is a mobile game Big Moss's secret room. Alright, Excalibur. The animations are nice. That's Seven Deadly Sins Origin. Is there anything else? Little trailer at the end. Nah, that's pretty much it. I really like their little Goomba icon. But uh, yeah, nah, that's pretty much Seven Deadly Sins Origin. It looks really good. I still don't know if I feel like I feel like Genshin does look better. Like just like just look at the fingers here, right? Like not really a too much detail when it comes to like the animations. And this is supposed to be an animation, right? But it's also very possible that they're using the same uh, what is it called? The same style art for the animations, which I personally like a bit more. I hate it when like the animation is like really clean and then you get to the game and it's like dog shit. <laughs> you ever play uh, the original Final Fantasy 7? <laughs> oh my god bro, the animations like for Bahamut was like sick and then you get to like the... The clay doll figures that you got going on here. You got Sauce Buck in the back. You got some cool specials though. I so obviously this is going to be a gacha game because gacha games are the ones that make money. 
I'm interested to see how they release characters. Like, just based on the art that they're using for Hauser and Gilgamesh. I, I, what, what is the pink guy's name? hair name? Pink guy? Guy with pink hair. Seven deadly sins. Gil Thunder, bruh. Okay, I, I was close. I was close. The seeing as they use the same art for Gil Thunder as well as Hauser for this game, it's very possible that they'll just use a lot of the characters that they had in Grand Cross. And since Grand Cross is like two, three years old, I, I don't even know at this point. Like they have a lot of assets to go through, so they can come out with several different Gil Thunders, there several different Hausers. I'm hoping that it's not like Genshin, where they'll release a character, release a couple gear for it, and then just throw the character away, and they'll probably still be good, because it, it, it just is, and then they just power creep the game to hell, which gacha games tend to do, but like, like I, I, play, I play a couple gacha games that they buff, they nerf if they need to, but they'll buff old characters so that they're actually useful, so you don't feel like you wasted your money summoning for a character and i think that's probably the biggest issue that i've had when it comes to a lot of these gacha games like bleach brave souls grand cross uh what are the other games data lot no not data live uh don machi data live too yeah <laughs> like, like all these fucking gacha games they just literally just they come out with characters they become garbage after like six months for the most part and then you're supposed to keep summoning and summoning and summoning they give you just enough to summon and hopefully you pull something one time or hopefully you saved enough to pull the broken character but we'll see how it goes uh either way i'll probably give it a shot i do actually like the seven deadly sins ip i'm not very like well versed in it i just genuinely just liked what i've seen from seven deadly sins aside from season three and four <laughs> i'm still impressed that they're doing I'm not gonna lie, I'm actually pretty impressed that they're gonna be doing underwater. And there actually looks like there's some stuff underwater. It doesn't look like there's much, which is kind of interesting. Like, like when she first dives in, you see like a sparkle right here. Let me, let me just slow it down. Load the volume. But yeah, this sparkle right here. So like as she dives down, so I'm assuming that that's gonna be like, yeah, that's a chest over there. So that's that's pretty cool. I'm glad that they're actually doing that. But I guess I'll leave it at that. He says, Grind will catch up with me up. Stay blessed. Like, comment, subscribe to you. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Thanks for coming to check out the channel. I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.